Hello again, and welcome to another installment of Fish Pittsburgh's Tip of the Week. Today, I have the weightless rig already all set up, ready to go, but what I want is a quick fall rate. Now, many companies sell lead nail inserts. Very flexible, pliable, you can put them in any soft plastic and they still work. What you do with them is just take them and stick them right in the nose of the bait, slide them all the way up, and the lure will have it all the way in it. Now it's going to fall a little nose heavy. You can insert it in the mid body so it doesn't, in the tail if you want the tail to fall. Let me show you. I'm going to pull this rig off. And this time I'm going to put this 7 inch Senko on. And anybody that fishes a Senko knows when a Senko falls, it falls with a side to side shimmy. You get a little wiggle back and forth, not much variation. Usually it falls coming down, just like say. Instead of using this lead based product, what I've gone and done is went to my typical hardware store, picked up a two inch or an inch and a half finish nail. And what I'm gonna do is insert it into the tail of the Senko. It's gonna change the way this bait falls. Now, when it falls, instead of it falling flush, what's gonna happen is it's gonna fall probably to the side slightly, maybe vertical, but that tip's gonna fall first and then it's gonna wanna lay down. As that happens, when I pick it up, it's going to be back vertical and give it a totally different action. If you change it back to the head, it's going to want to fall tail first. Same kind of action, except for the fact that once it's down, the head's going to pick up and give it a more erratic action. The tail is a more subtle approach. Thanks for joining me on this week's Tip of the Week.